what's up YouTube now hey a couple things I want to address here in the intro in, in my intro here is I know it's been a while since you know my beautiful sexy face has been on camera it's only because you know I was just messing around with my uh, Elgato and stuff like that and I really like the fact that with the Elgato when I, when I record game footage I can upload it at 60 frames 1080p 60 frames as opposed to my video editor like the one I use with because I use my camera it only does like 30 frames and I was just kind of I was just kind of having fun with that I'm like hey look at this video I'm like I'm putting up like Super Nintendo footage you know it, actually it was uh it was virtual console Wii U footage but I was putting on there I'm just playing like these these 2D games Super Nintendo games like 60 frames per second I was just having fun with it so that's why I was doing that and that's all I really wanted to say about that. Also, I know I said I was going to take the month off to work on other videos, and that's still true, but I did say I was going to try. <laughs> but I, you know, recent events, I, just, I said every once in a while, I might just rear my head and just have to feel, feel compelled to make a video. And today, ladies and gentlemen, is that day. And this is more specifically addressed to, you know, my, my three buddies here, you know who I talk to every now and then on YouTube, Real Gamer, uh, Dave's had enough, and Bear Hugger to an extent. We don't talk as much as I would like to, but you know, I'm just a. Uh, the recent events, you know, again with the controversy about how you know their opinions on Nintendo and how fuck how we how we was fucked up and stuff like that and said another thing. And I want to say that I agree with everything everything that you guys are saying. You know, I am not here to argue with you, you're absolutely right, Real Gamer is saying that the Wii U was a failed Nintendo console, and I, I have to agree with you, and you know, and stuff like that, I'm not saying you're wrong, and stuff like that, there's a lot they fucked up with with the Wii U, I'm not going to lie about that anymore, but there's a couple of things that everybody said that I wanted to address, that I feel, as much as I agree with all of you, I feel that there are factors that you have missed when it comes to well, talking about Nintendo and third party as a whole. And I think this is something that nobody seems to want to address. Everybody, like, either they ignore this fact, ignore these facts, or they don't, they don't think about it. You know, it's not something that comes to their head. So, listen up, you beautiful bitches, because I'm going to fuck you up with some truth right now. Let, let's start with Dave, things you said in the video I saw you talk about about how you feel, is it just Nintendo wants us to remain kings or something like that? And you went on this whole thing about how Nintendo is just like ignoring all these other things because they want to stick to tried and true family entertainment, kid, 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 kid oh, they want, all these games are kiddie and stuff like that. Um, I'm not, I, I, like I said, I agree with a lot of things you said in the video, but the answer to your question is not as complicated as you'd imagine to be. And the truth is about the Wii U and the kitty image is that basically when it comes to Nintendo and third parties, Nintendo fucked up. Alright? That that's that's pretty much what happened here. They couldn't get along with third parties for whatever reason. Lord knows they tried. The first year they had like these the, they had the third party games, but Nintendo and third party just couldn't seem to see eye to eye with, you know, first of all there's the fact that the third party games gimped the Wii U versions, because I'm thinking like, wow, well, well, that's just a... They were kind of mistaken about the audience they were getting. And because, like, a lot of these games weren't reaching Call of Duty numbers, or the Wii U wasn't reaching, like, the, the million sold like Nintendo projected or promised, you know, I could see where they kind of said, yeah, fuck this, and they left. And that is basically what happened here. And it's not... And the only reason why Nintendo has the games they're doing is because that's all they have. You know, it's all they have. I mean, all they have right now is Mario and Donkey Kong and Zelda. And even though there's other games that they, they're sitting on that they refuse to make, which is like something Real Gamer said, by the way. Get, they have all these other games, first party, second party games, that they could bring out, but they won't. And it boggles the mind of why they're not doing that. I don't, like, they refuse. Refuse to make a new F-Zero game. I mean, come on. We've all talked about this. We all know damn well if... All Nintendo has to do is make an F-Zero game and make some kind of online structure. It, it's going to sell, but they they straight out refuse to make an F-Zero game, all right? That's what it is. And they're saying, well, we're not making an F-Zero game because we don't know what to do with it. Motherfucker, you know exactly what to do with it. You just do what you do with Mario Kart. Just make it faster. I mean, they're pretty much putting 200cc. They're putting, like, all these F-Zero type features in Mario Kart... But still, they want to say they can't, they don't know what to do with the F-Zero game. 
bullshit. And as far as uh, Real Gamer doing comparisons about how, you know, oh, well, it's not like the, the, the NES or 64 days. And you're right, again, you're right. But, and I left a comment in if you're talking about this, is basically a lot of the third party system, a lot of the third parties that, you know, were out back then just flat out don't exist anymore. I mean, where, where's games like Midway and Acclaim? And they're, they're all dead. And and the, the ones that do exist, they're, they're still, the ones that are still around, you know, what exactly are they doing other than, like, first-person shooter, broken DLC-ridden, practically microtransaction crap. They, too, they, too, are sitting on a bunch of third, a bunch of their IPs that they not only won't put on Nintendo, they won't put on anything. Now, I can understand. I can understand why a lot of these third parties don't want to put any of their games on the Wii U. And I, I kind of get that. I kind of do. But what's their excuse for not putting these IPs on, like, other systems? Why, why is there no IP, these IPs they have, why aren't they working on it for the PS4? Or the Xbox One, or hell, even even the PC. And have you seen what was going on with Final Fantasy the last couple of years? They didn't really put any of their games on on a Nintendo system, but <laughs> they sucked. And whether or not these games ended up on the, on the Nintendo system or not, they they were crap. I mean, and look what what the fuck is going on with Konami? I mean, look at that. They're they're can't they they got rid of Kojima, which shouldn't have been really been a factor. But they're can't they're possibly canceling Silent Hill. Why? Why are they canceling Silent Hill? Why are the why is this game being canceled? And other than you know Metal Gear now, what else has Konami been doing? Yeah, they've been working on fucking what? Like I said, Silent Hills, but now that's supposedly canceled because uh, Kojima quit or they fired him. That's not an excuse. All right, what was going on with Konami? Suddenly they're they're going to shit all of a sudden out of nowhere, and they're not really doing. Where where are the games? Where are the fucking games? There's all these IPs they could do, but they're not. What what's your excuse for that? I can see, like I said, I can see why they're not putting games on the Wii U, but why are they not putting these games on the PS4 or the Xbox One, which have bigger install bases? You know, where where are the JRPGs lately? I mean, they're still coming out for PS. Three, I mean, shit, I bought, just the other day, I bought a, a new JRPG. I think this game is relatively new. I heard it was like, I heard it came out from Koei Tecmo. It's a, uh, Koei Tecmo right there. You know, you know what they do. But, yeah, so, new new RPG I bought for the PS3, but where are the PS4 JRPGs? Seriously. I mean, I, I heard some are being announced, but I don't know what they are. And where, where are those? Where are all these games that these companies are making or these companies made, but they don't... I mean, have you seen what happened to Castlevania lately? Seriously. I mean, who... Did anybody like the Lords of Shadow series? I, I love the first game, by the way. I thought Lords of Shadow was pretty good. Uh, the the one for 3DS was so-so, and I haven't even played um, the new one, and I have not heard good things, but I still want to try that for myself, so I'll probably get around to that one day and decide for myself. But so far, I have not heard too much about that. So even though I'm saying even though these games aren't they aren't making games for the Wii U, why aren't they making these games period? For for like anything. PS4, Xbox One, PC, Sega, what the fuck is Sega doing? They have a shitload. They are stick like I know Sega is like, you know, in some kind of trouble and they're basically not making any other console games probably other than Sonic. And they're going to go more towards PC gaming. That's fine. So you have, like, all these, like, series that 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 you have, but won't put on anything. Not even PC. I mean, Shenmue. People have been wanting a Shenmue game, Shenmue 3, for, like, the longest fucking time. And Sega won't do it. Let's see. What else? Um, Fantasy Star. I know there's, like, some Fantasy Star online that are doing it. Where's New Fantasy Star? Skies of Arcadia. You have a shitload of these games. Oh, fuck. I don't know. Redo. Do, you know, with the, what is it? Streets of Rage. I mean, do what you, do what they did with the Double Dragon series. You know, that Double Dragon game came out for, Double Dragon Neon. That came out for the PS3, Xbox 360 a couple of years ago. Re, redo it like that. What's the excuse? Where are these games? Why aren't these games getting made? 
It doesn't matter if they're on Wii or not. So I think that's the part that a lot of people seem to be forgetting, is a lot of these games, you know, a lot of these companies don't exist anymore, and the ones that do are only making, like, first-person shooters, and that's it. You know, when they have all these other games they could make, and I, I want to know what the excuse is why these games aren't coming for the PS4 or Xbox One. Seriously. I would like somebody to answer that for me. I mean, if you have an answer and can and can give me the answer, perfect. Good. That's why I'm asking. That is why I'm asking. Answer my question. <laughs> I want to know, like, I want to know where the, where, I want to know the answer. That's why I'm asking. <laughs> so, uh, that's all I really had to say about that. I just want to make a quick video about that. So, uh, like I said, I'm not saying you guys are wrong. You are absolutely right. I agree with everything you said, but it's just that you're you're missing a couple of things that nobody seems to want to talk about. Not just you guys, not just you, but a lot of people when they're doing they're doing this whole like console war thing, they're not looking at it from all angles. All right, there is good and there is bad. And yes, I believe Nintendo needs to fix their fucking relationship with third party, but third party also needs to fix themselves. I mean, I've seen you guys all <laughs> talk about how. You know, you're fed up with the with the broken games and like the DLC, and you're right. I agree with you on that. I agree with you. Nintendo needs to work more with third party. But all this needs to this all the the healing needs to begin. Alright? There is a long ass healing process that needs to start. And you gotta fix third party. You gotta fix Nintendo. All this shit needs to be fixed. Because right now, it's a broken fucking mess. And nobody wants to fight that fight. They just want to fight the console war. Do you know what I'm saying? So, like I said, this is a factor that a lot of people are missing. That nobody seems to want to talk about or nobody thinks of. And that's all I'm saying. That's, that's all I'm bringing to the table. I'm not trying to argue with you. Like I said, I think you guys are right. But you're missing. There are still holes in your argument. And there's probably holes in my argument, too, that I'm making right now. I don't know. Like I said, that's why I asked if, like, these companies... If they're making all these other games, I mean, for whatever system, why are they making, like, these other IPs? You know, there's a shitload of, of games that they're out there, but they don't want to make. You know, for, like, and come on, don't tell me because their audience isn't there. You have, like, what, what's the PS4 install base right now? 22 million? 22 fucking million people, all right, that you could probably redo these games, say they're new, and they'll probably fucking believe you because they're not gonna, they didn't play like these games back in the NES, Super Nintendo Day, Sega Genesis games. You can redo, you want to remaster, redo games, do games from this generation, and most people won't know the fucking difference. <laughs> they really won't because they didn't play games back then. They're playing them now, but they weren't playing them back then. So if you want to bring games to newer audiences, do this, all right? Do these games and just tell people, oh yeah, it's new. They'll, they'll fucking believe you. They don't care. And do, like, you want to sit there and, okay, no, I'm not gonna, I was going to say something, but I'm not going to say it because I don't want to give many ideas. But seriously, there are a lot of IPs out there by other companies that are still around that they just simply won't make for the current systems, whether it be Nintendo system or not. And I would like to know what the fucking excuse for that is. All right, that's all I'm saying. So uh, just wanted to say that, bring it out there, and uh, that's it. Now I have uh, games playing, videos to try to make, so I will see you guys later.